Abraham, yeah. people can have a fairy tale anytime they wish. Yeah. All they need to do is come to somewhere that's fantasy, yeah. like a forest, then they need to walk through it and imagine that they are the fairy tale. Yeah. And this world was built for them only. Yeah. And then that fairy tale would become theirs. And then they would live in the fairy tale that they created because you can have a fairy tale if you come to a fairy tale place. Yeah. And how much money has it cost us to be here? None. No money. No money. So would you agree that the best times that we've had in our life have been when we don't spend any money? Yeah. So money is just an excuse. Yeah. The reality is, if you want a fairy tale, you just got to go and get it. This is my wish. Ladies and gentlemen, fairy tales are you living fairy tales. You need to come to a fairy tale place. Places where fairies and trolls and all of the other creatures hibernate from humans. Yes, we don't see them on film, but we know that they are there. The fairy tale is all in our minds. So please, don't be blind. Please open your mind and please realize that fairy tales are all around us and we can have them any day of the week, any time of the year. Go to a forest like this one in Rowhedge and please breathe in the air. Don't be afraid to care and remember that you are the fairy tale. And to someone out there, they love you very much. And you might not realise it, but you would be very missed if you wasn't here. And you are the fairy tale. Just because you don't get told every five minutes that you're loved, we are all loved by someone. And ladies and gentlemen, life is what we make it. And I choose to make my life a fairy tale. I just need to take myself to the fairy tale places sometimes to show me the fairy tale is still real. If you want a fairy tale, people, do what I'm doing. Come to a forest like this. Imagine all the things you like remember when you were little. See how they feel now as an adult and still try and make them real. Because, ladies and gentlemen, if you want a fairy tale, you just need to go and get it. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my fairy tale. And if you want it, you just need to make it happen and that would be your wish. Me and Abraham, we're in bliss. We walk around this beautiful world. And to me, it's pure fairy tale. Abraham, what do you feel here? What are you sensing with the fairy tale side of it all? I feel one with it. You see, the ground, the trees, the sky. And I'm in it. Walking on a path in it. You know, it's all part of the picture. Exactly as Abraham just said, we are the picture. We are the dream. If we want a fairy tale, then you don't need to scream. Make your fairy tale real. You may think, what the hell am I on about? I'm on about people not going insane. I'm on about people not going mental. I'm on about people holding on to who they are. Me, I've always believed in fairy tales. And even though I'm a 44-year-old man, I am still going on about fairy tales. No one can stop me. This is my wish. And Abraham is with me, and he understands my needs. My needs are to make fairy tales real. So I bring Abraham to these places. And the man is smiling. Look at his face. Just look at his face. Abraham, there's a shortcut. Abraham, look at Abraham's face. The man is loving the fairy tale. And we made the fairy tale real. It's our wish. And it hasn't cost any money. So how about you make your fairy tales come true? And there's no need to use money as an excuse. And there's no need to use anything as an excuse. All you need to do is believe in yourself and believe in your dreams and believe in your fairy tales. Ladies and gentlemen, come and get your fairy tale. It is my wish. It is your wish. Welcome to real life fairy tales right now. Fairies, trolls, Danny and Abraham. Welcome to Real Life Fairy Tales. Abraham, is it Real Life Fairy Tales? Yeah, look at it. Talk us through it, Abraham. What are we seeing here? Look at it. You can imagine anything. 
coming in, coming out, like. It's all alive. Abraham, can you handle this hill? Yeah. Should I hold on to my back? I'll be all right. Are you sure? You're 74. I might not be all right. <laughs> I think you stood a bit then. All right, this is going to be... <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, me and Abraham have just come down that hill. Ladies and gentlemen, we have just made a fairy tale real. Yeah. Thank you, Abraham, for helping me make that video. Thank you, Daddy. Thank you. Is it a real-life fairy tale? It is. Did we just make it happen? Yeah.